Okay, wait for that bike to pass. 131 South Eureka here in the hilltop. From what I uh, was told, this property is in pretty good overall shape. I just circled it on the outside. It looks pretty good too. We'll see how it is on the inside. Looks like we're in a good little section here, the hilltop. Almost looks like that might be an owner occupant right across the street. If not, they're a tenant who takes some pride. We do have a boarded up property right there. Other than that, the immediate neighbors look solid. The immediate neighbors look real good. And uh, even the ones down the road down the down the road look good too steps here look uh, like they might need something something done there it's all aluminum siding and it's all still intact this porch looks like it's fine porch ceiling is good too Good enough for the area. Our ports look solid. All right. Beautiful day, my goodness. All right, we need some paint work here. But that's really about the only section where you're gonna need paint is on the porch. Because like I said, the rest of the house is aluminum siding, as you can see. No, you can't see it. Take my word for it. It's aluminum. And uh, maybe power wash it if you want. You don't have to do that. Foundation. Looks very solid. I didn't see any cracks or anything when I circled. This little side door looks like it needs a maybe a new door. Maybe some paint around the window frames. Windows, none are broken. Looks like they're older windows, but none are broken, none are boarded up. Here's our back. I believe this is the two car garage for this property. I think if I remember the conversation I had with the seller, here's the back of the house. I'm gonna be running out of battery here in a second. little back deck area is in good shape. Let's see up there and the soffits are all good to go. Everything's solid there. This foundation is strong all the way around. Looks like it's even got AC. Go see this garage. If right, this is the two car garage, or actually one car. Well, two, no, it's two car. Just a old fashioned door on the left, real old fashioned door for the property. And I was impressed with the back alley. A lot of these neighborhoods, it's you look around and there's just all boarded up houses. In this section here, I don't see any boarded up homes. So it's definitely good from that regard. All right, we'll wait on the seller and hopefully be getting in this guy here real soon. Take some here on the inside. So we're inside 131 South Eureka. Main living space here. Do you know the last time the, the roof was replaced on this property? No, I'll be honest, I can't tell you. I can't tell you hardly anything about this place. Okay. Honest. I am like, I'm like the daughter's boyfriend that I'm the one that wasn't working today. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it, no. they made you come on over and let me in. Right. Okay. Got some older windows here, but they're in good shape. They're in good enough shape. Ceiling looks good. It's not hanging down. Moldy or anything like that. Obviously, we've got a lot of cosmetics in here. Carpet and paint are going to be huge. Yeah, it looks like they just ripped the wallpaper.
paper off of that dump. Yeah, were they about to paint or something? Or Yeah, I think somebody, uh, I think the grandson thought he was moving in here, was going to move in here. Okay. Yeah, I've heard a lot of horror stories about how that works out. Usually it doesn't work out, but... Small built-in cabinets here. Okay, I see the appliances are gone. Is the light switch out now? Down to the basement wow. here. This is thing I've never seen that before. <laughs> Put some blinds on the doorway. That works. All right. Oh, we have a dog. Yeah, I can smell that dog. Yeah. <laughs> Smells like the dog spent some time down here too. Yeah. All right. So we still have all the plumbing. It looks like in place. Look like yeah, okay two weeks ago this was an inhabited yeah. house so yeah, yeah so we still have plumbing got that copper moved? plumbing still in here as I knew, she was keeping warm and taking showers and all that so yeah the furnace was working. okay Okay. Here's the furnace. Yeah, this looks like a newer furnace. This thing doesn't look too bad. Right. Yeah, it's not a gravity fed one. Yeah. Some of them. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. I'll head on upstairs, take a look up there. It's a wide staircase. I've never seen such a wide staircase. To the basement. The floor here, of course. They turn the water off or they keep. I don't know, man. No. That looks like it. Oh, really? Does it work? No. Um, hmm. Alright, let's head upstairs here. It's a bird in here. <laughs> it just caught me off guard. Uh -huh. Yeah. There's a bird. All right. Everything's still intact here. Obviously, this is all cosmetic stuff. Got a beautiful old pink tub. Some gorgeous looking. Wallpaper. I like being a monster. I gotta try to save it, though, man. There's another one over here behind these blinds. I think it's the same one. Oh, is that the same one? Yeah. Alright. Alright, bird, try this. Got a bird that's in here. <laughs> Alright, bedroom number one. Uh, go that way. Bird, there you go. Go that way. Make it work, dude. You went out. You did? Good. Yeah. Bedroom two. It's a bigger bedroom here. Looks like somebody started to paint on the ceiling. Small little old fashioned closet. Alright, and bed three. Wow, that's a big closet. Somebody built that up. More work to be done over here. Condition. Bless you. That roof looks real good. I don't know when 
that roof. No idea when that roof was replaced. It looks no, it looks like pretty a, darn new. It looks like a good one though. That one's like I mean, I don't, I'm kind of scared of heights, but I ain't gonna talk it yet.